Hello everyone and welcome to our very first Beach Volley Vikings tutorial. Today we're gonna show you how to receive the ball. And we have great help from the Dutchies Brouwer and Musen. They're one of the best teams in the world and together with them we are going to tell you our keywords when it comes to reception. So after this video I really hope that you guys have learned a lot and uh, that you use this when you uh, go on the field and practice yourself. So let's just get started. Hi I'm Alex, nice to meet you all. Uh, focus or some keywords in reception for me is uh, especially focus on the legs because I tend to think, yeah, receiving is, I do with my arms. So I think about the contact of the ball on my arms. But the most important thing for me to start with is uh, the legs and the preparation, moving the legs, get into the right position and from there uh, receive. So why is it so important to move your legs? If you can see in this clip of me where I'm not using my legs, I get aced. It is so important to get your body behind the ball because the chance of you missing the reception is way bigger when you're not doing it. The same for me, uh, move your legs and try to get the ball in the center of your body. Try to get behind the ball and if you can't do it then you can fix it with your arms but always try to get the ball in the center of your body. I know you guys are from Norway and you like fishing, you know, fishing. But in reception, I think um, it's preferable to not move the arms too much. Ball under the platform, keep the platform here, use the legs, but then only use the legs and shoulders to, uh, to play the ball and not necessarily the arms, because this makes the platform unstable. Go early and try to take the ball higher, because you have more control when it's, if it's drop, you can still go down. But if you go down and it drops, you can't do anything. Try to take the ball earlier. Uh, the most uh, important uh, skill we actually have is to read and to move in the ball trajectory. And then the skill is, uh, your body is like a racket, so it's, uh, uh, you have a very short time to adjust. But why? Why is it so important with reception? Being a good receiver is the first step to becoming a good volleyball player. You can be as good as you want to hit the ball, but if you can't receive properly, you will never get the chance to attack. That's why I advise all players out there to practice on their reception and setting. I have been spending so much time on reception the last, I don't know, 10, 10 years. And we have been doing it at least half an hour every practice. But that's maybe also why we're our number one seed in the world. Because we are really good at reception and setting. Um... There are five keywords when it comes to reception. Get the feet towards the ball. Don't move the arms too much. Don't do it like this. Just keep it steady. Get the ball in the center of your body. So always try to have the ball right in front of you. If you have to, you can open up. But try to always get the ball in the center of your body. Have a momentum in towards the ball. And the last thing is to take the ball high. So don't take the ball inside where your body is, take the ball in front of your body. A ball should fit between your body and your arm. And one tip we have for all of you is to record yourself in slow motion with your cell phone. Because then you can see all the details. And you can see if you pass the ball inside your body, outside, if you have your steps right, if you move your feet towards the ball in the right way. And uh, yeah, that's just really important. We do it all the time and I think that's a really good idea for you to start with as well. Okay, that's all for now. I really hope you learned something new and uh, that you're gonna use these keywords in your practice and try to write them down and uh, think about them every time you step on the court to practice and I'm sure you will become a way, way better receiver than you are right now. So, thanks for now. We will be back with another tutorial very soon. So, stay tuned for that.